Okay, hello everybody. Can you listen to me? Can everybody hear me? Hello, yes, teacher. Good morning. Thank you. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Okay, good evening. Good night, teacher. Good night, good night. Very good. Good night, teacher. Thank you. Good night. Um, let's see. We are waiting for some participants. We were supposed to have twenty participants right now, but uh, I only have ten. So let's let's give a little, uh, a few minutes, okay? Let me just prepare something here. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Waiting for some more participants, okay? Just uh, two more minutes. Okay. Thank you very much. So far we have 12 participants, but let's begin because we're supposed to have uh, 20 participants, but right now I have only uh, 12. Okay, let's begin by introducing myself. Okay, my name is Alcides Hernandez. You got my name? Can you hear me? My name is Ricardo Campos. Good, good, good. Very good, very good. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Let me do a, a little introduction myself and then I'm going to ask one by one. My name is Alcides Hernandez. I'm from San Miguel. I'm an English teacher. I live in San Salvador in Colonia Pro Blanca. I work with English Corporativo. And uh, in my free time, I like to read, cook, and watch TV. Um, I'm 35 years old. And my email is uh, the English guru at g um, at outlook.com. Okay, and my phone number is 7289-6053. Okay, so that's my little introduction. So let's start with introducing yourself. For example, um, Walter, Walter, can you introduce yourself, please? Hello. 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 Yeah, we can hear you, Walter. Go. Okay, my name is Walter Flores. I am from San Vicente. Okay, and, and I like watch TV, a new, ¿cómo se dice? Noticia, a newspaper. The news. I like to watch the news. Okay. And how old are you, Walter? Okay, no Walter. Okay, Damaris, can you introduce yourself, please? Hello, my name is Damaris Rodriguez. I am from San Vicente. I like swimming in pool. Good, very good, very good. Um, let's see, 
Natalie, can you introduce yourself, please? Yes, teacher. Uh, hello. My name is, is Natalie Osorio. Um, I am 27 years old and I am a student. Very good, very good. Where do you work? And only a study. Oh, you study. Where, where do you study? Uh, and the university. Okay, good. Okay, um, Samuel, Samuel Parada, can you introduce yourself, please? Hello, teacher. Hello. Um, my name is Samuel Parada. I live in San, uh, San Miguel. San Miguel, uh, uh, I like to uh, watch TV a sport. Uh, what, is, what is your favorite team? Repeat. What is your favorite team? No, your team, team, uh, equipo, equipo favorito. Equipo, ah, uh, 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 el que tiene en la parte de atrás. <laughs> <laughs> that is good, that's good, nice, uh, nice. Yeah. I thought you were going to say Aguila. No? Aguila, yeah, también. You know yeah. that I'm from San Miguel, but I'm living here in San Salvador right now. Okay, good, thank you, okay. thank you, Samuel. Um, let's okay. see who's next, Natalia, can you introduce yourself, please? Natalia, can you hear me? No, okay. Um, Rocio, can you introduce yourself, please? Hello. Hello. Uh, my name is Rocio Manzano. I am from San Salvador. I live is in San Martin. And I, I am was in kindergarten. And I I like um, cooking and see. okay good so you are um, a kindergarten teacher right yes teacher very, very good nice nice I like that thank you Rocio uh, Jose Hernandez can you introduce yourself please hi teacher hello hello I am Jose Hernandez I am from San Salvador. I work hard work store. I like play football. You like to play football, right? Yes. And where do you work, Jose? A hardware store. Oh, okay. Very good. In a hardware store. Very good. Nice. Um, Sammy, can you do Sammy Garcia? Can you do a, a little introduction, please? Good evening, everybody. My name is Sammy Garcia. I from I am from San Salvador. I live in Ilopango. I listen. I like listening to music, and I am thirty years old. Okay, good. Thank you very much. Okay, um, let's see. Roberto Amenda, can you Avendaño? I think so. Avendaño. Yes, 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 teacher. Okay, can you introduce yourself, please? Okay. Uh, hi, everyone. Good evening. My name is Roberto Avendaño. I'm 23 years old. I live in Santa Ana. Um, I work at Decotex. And in my free time, I like to watch the Criminal Minds program. Nice. Okay, good. Thank you, Roberto. Let's see, Antonio Ortiz, can you introduce yourself, please? My name is Antonio. Um, I'm from Morazan. I live in Segundo Montes. Um, I work in the teacher in the university. Um, I, I am 35 years old. Um, I like to play the guitar. You like to play the guitar? Very good. Nice, nice. I like that. Okay, Hosanna Cruz, please.
Hi, my name is Osana. I am 29 years old. I am from San Salvador. I have, I have five brothers. My favorite genre of music is balada. My favorite color is blue. I study in university. Very nice. Nice, nice. Thank you. Thank you, Rosana. Okay, let's see, Beatrice. Can you do a little introduction, please, Bea? Hi, everyone. My name is Beatriz Elias. I am 36 years old. I work in the Hospital de Diagnostico. I have a two daughters. Only. <laughs> hey, thank you, Bea. Um, Beatriz, you are a nurse or a doctor? Um, secretary. <laughs> I, thought, yeah, secretary. <laughs> yeah, I thought because you were working at the hospital, so I said maybe a nurse or a doctor. <laughs> Thank you. Let's see, Sofia. Sofia Ayala, can, can you introduce yourself, please? Good evening. My name is Sofia Ayala. I'm from San Vicente, Aileen, San Salvador. I am a psychologist. I work in... It's called kindergarten. Okay. Uh, and I, um, well, <laughs> I know. Oh, okay, good. Don't worry, don't worry. It's okay. Okay, um, Ricardo, could, can you introduce yourself, please? Hey, my name is Ricardo Campos. Uh, I am uh, 40. For a year out, yeah, my my favorite. No, I I live I live in a Washington. Yeah, my favorite my favorite uh, colors is yellow. Yellow. I I work in the foundation foundation with the children. Good only. Okay, nice. All right, thank you very much. Okay, as I said, you know, like, uh, nice meeting you all. Oh, I forgot Rafa. Rafael Escobar, can you introduce yourself, please? Okay, can you hear me? Yes, yes, we can hear you, thank you. Okay, hi everyone, good evening. Hello, My name evening. is Rafael Escobar, I live in Santa Ana. Uh, I work in Antigua, Cuscatlán. I like play football in my free time. I am 45 years old. Uh, nice to meet you. Nice meeting you too. Okay, I, I see that somebody is, um, there's one participant that is logging in, but is not staying. Okay, so let's start by, by giving you this information as you can see we are pre-intermediate so you guys uh, can understand a lot of English already so let's see here okay let me just share my presentation so you can see it okay here let's share can everybody see this screen? Yes. Thank you. Yes, teacher. Good. So the first topic that, that you guys have in, in, the, in the, you know, to work is where are you from? So this is part of personal information questions. Okay. So it, this is for, for beginners, exactly. So these are little questions that we're going to go. So today is Monday, June 1st, 2020. And my name, you know, is Alcides Hernandez. I'm from San Miguel. And I have been teaching English for 15 years already. So, you know, I have been, been teaching a lot. Okay, so this is my information. Whenever you have any questions after class or during the, during, during the day, you can send me a little message and I'm going to answer as soon as possible. So you can get my information, you can write it down or whatever, you know. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. Got you got my information already? Uh okay. not yet. Oh, not yet. Okay. Um okay, teacher. Thank you very much. Okay, let's move on. Um, so for today we're going to be talking about where are you from? That's a very easy question. So let's see. Um, these are the rules for the virtual classroom. And, and I, I like for, um, you know, to comply with these little things, you know. Let's see. Um, let me have somebody reading it. Uh, Antonio Ortiz, can, can you read this, uh, the rules, please? Hello, teacher. Yes, can, can you read the rules, please? Um, I don't understand. Uh, can you read this for, for everybody? Um, Logging in on time. Uh, be, uh, be respected uh, at all time. Do you work? Participate a lot. Follow instruction. Speak out loud. Very good, very good. So as you can see, those are the rules. Log in on time. Be respectful at all times. Do your work. Participate a lot. Follow instructions and speak out loud. Any questions? Do you understand this? Everybody understands? No. Yes, teacher. Okay, no question. Okay, so for today, we're going to identify, discuss, and talk about personal information questions, okay? Thanks. Good. Let's see. Okay, this little conversation, I, I always like it because, you know, uh, it gives me time for, uh, for everybody to do intervention. So let's see. Uh, let's see, Rafael and Beatriz. You, Rafael, you start, please. Okay. Uh, which? The, this which one? one? Here, here. You start here. Okay. Okay. You're going, you're going to be yellow, and Beatriz is going to be red. Okay. Okay. Go. Uh, uh, <laughs> pero lo leo tal como está ahí. No, no, you're going to say, hello there, uh, I'm, I'm in your name. Use your name, okay? Ah, oh, okay, there. okay, okay. Uh, hello there, I'm Rafael. What's your name? Is this? Continue, continue. Uh, is this your first time talking on talking the online English model? Taking, taking. Taking. Yes. Taking. Okay, Beatriz, your turn. Hey, hello. Rafael, no, actually, I have been talking of English model online. What about you? Okay, Beatriz, taking, taking. taking. Very good, <laughs> taking. very good. Don't worry. Okay. Okay, uh, Rafa. Okay. Well, this is my first time taking online English models. Do you know what are? Do you know we are going to learn today? Yes, I know. We are going to learn to successfully, successfully identify, discuss, identify, 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 discuss, 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 and talk about personal information question. Thank you very okay. much. Okay, congratulations, Beatriz. <laughs> hey, guys. Me too. <laughs> you know, I'm here to more or less, you. more or less. <laughs> Okay, I'm here to help you. Whenever you make a mistake, I'm going to correct you, okay? I hope you don't okay. get angry. Don't oh. get angry, please, because, you know, my, my, my the main idea is for you to do it very good, okay? Mm -hmm. oh. Thank you. Okay, very good. So, uh, Osana and Roberto, can you do the, uh, the introduction, please? Osana and Roberto. Osana, you just start, please. Okay. Um, oh. Hello, the hello day. I am Osana. What's your name? Is the your first time taking the only English model? Online, online, online. Very good. Hey, hello, Osana. No, actually, I have been uh, taking, taking all in 
taking our English module online. What about you? Very good. Well, this is the, my first time taking online English module. Do you know? Do you know what we are going to learn today? Yes, I know. We are going to learn to successfully identify 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 discuss uh, dis discuss discuss and talk talk about personal information questions. Very good, very good. Okay, these two words you're going to be seeing in all the, the classes because I always put this successfully identify discuss successfully identify discuss. So you're going to see it every day when we have class, okay? Okay, let's see who's next. Two more people, uh, two more pairs. I'm going to do two more pairs. Let's see, Rocio and Samuel. Rocio, you start, please. Yes. Hello. There, I am Rocio. What's your name? Is this your first day taking the only English models? Online, online. Online. Very good. Hey, hello, Rocio. No, please. I have been taking all English models model online. What about you? Okay, wait. well, Samuel, Samuel. Actually, 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 actually. And this is taking, taking. taking. Good. Okay. Continue. Well, this is the my my first day taking online English models. Do you know what we are going? To learn today. Yes, I I I go. I, I know. know. I know. Where where I going to learn to to successfully to sexually uh, identify 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 discuss and talk about personal information question. Very good. Thank you very much. I see that everybody is having a little problem with successfully identify discuss everybody repeating successfully 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 successfully, successfully, successfully identify 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 discuss 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 thank you now let's see who's next um Damaris and Carla. Damaris and Carla, please. Damaris, you start. Okay. Damaris. Hello. Hello there. I I am Carla. What's your name? Is this your first time taking the online English model? Hey, hello, Carla. No, actually. Uh, I have been taking our English model online. What's about you? Well, this the where is it, the my first time taking online English model? Do you come? What do you know? we do you are? Know? Do, do you know? know what? Do you know what? Mm, what we are going to learn today? Yes, I know we are. I going to learn to to successfully successful successful successfully successful no successfully successfully yes identify identify this guy in the tall about the personal information question. Okay, good. Okay, good. This little introduction is going to be every time we come to class, so, so you can do a little introduction, okay? Okay, so now let's move on with the next thing. Personal information questions. Giving personal information in English. Sometimes people ask you for personal details, such as name, address, and date of birth. Here are some typical questions and ways you can answer. Now let's see who's going to read. Let's see 
Teacher, one yes. question. Yes. Uh, this word such, what meaning? What mean? Uh, such as yes. name. Yes. This yes. word such. Yes, in Spanish is tal como. Tal como. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. Let's see who can read. Um, Ricardo, can you read this part, please? Uh, if you want, I can read. Yes, you can read, please. Okay. Oh, Personal information. Oh, oh, sorry. Personal information, question. Okay. Uh, Giving give personal information in English, sometimes people ask you for personal details, such as name, address, and date of birth. Here are some typical questions and where you can answer. Okay, so um, these are typical questions that you can listen every day in English, okay? Mm -hmm. Moving on. What? Okay, listen to number one. Hello, my name is Tony. What's your name? Everybody repeating? Hello. My name is Tony. What's your name? Very good. Okay. Um, Beatriz. Beatriz. Can you repeat this, please? Hello. My name is Tony. What's your name? Okay. Um, Osana. Hello, my name is Tony. What's your name? Okay, let's do let's do a little exercise. I'm going to start with Ricardo. Okay, uh, I'm going to say hello. My name is Tony. What's your name? And then you're going to question to them to make that same question to another person. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm going to start with Ricardo. Hello, my name is Tony. What's your name? Hello, my name is Ricardo. Thank you very much. Now, Ricardo, as Hosanna. Okay. Hello, my name is Hosanna. What's your name? My name is Ricardo. Good. Rafael, as Roberto. Hello, my name is Rafael. What's your name? Hello, Rafael. My name is Roberto. Thank you very much. Antonio, okay. as Sammy. Hello, my name is Antonio. What's your name? My name is Sammy. Very good. Um, let me let me emphasize when you say name. My name is. My name is. So don't say my name. Name, no. Name. Name. My name. Like you put a little force, okay? Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. uh, Jose, ask Rocio. Hello, my name is Jose. Okay. What's your name? My name is Rocio. Thank you. Samuel, ask the Maris. Hello. My name is Samuel. What's your name, the Maris? No, only what's your name? <laughs> what's your name? What's your name? <laughs> uh, hello. My name Mommy. is, is Damari. Mommy. Very good. Mama. Let's see. Um, Carla, ask Walter. Hello, my name is Carla. What's your name? Hello, Carla. My name is Walter. Very good. Very good. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, I want to do a procedure, but I don't remember your names. Uh, so what I'm going to do is that I'm going to give you a number, and you remember your numbers, okay? Can you do that for me? Um, okay, uh, let, me give you, let me give you the name, uh, the numbers. Rafael, your number one. Rocio, yes. your number two. Damaris, your number three. Ricardo, your number four. Antonio, your number five. Beatriz, your number six. Os Osana, your number seven. Uh, Jose Hernandez, your number eight. Carla Ventura, your number nine. Roberto Avendaño, you're 10. Sammy, you're 11. Samuel, you're 12. 
Sofia, you're 13. Walter, you are 14. Okay? Okay. Very good. <coughs> Okay. okay, so let's start the next one. Next one. Listen to this. Uh, Tony, what's your last name, surname, family name? So in English, you can you can ask for, for last name in three different in three different questions. Number one, that the most common is what's your last name? But number two, what's your surname? And it's the same thing, apellido. What's your surname? Everybody repeating. What's your surname? Yes. What's, your, what's surname? your surname? What's your surname? What's your surname? What's your surname? Okay, and number three is family name. What's your family name? 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 Very good. Okay. Uh, let me see. Who's number one? Who is number one? Uh, me, Rafael. Okay. Uh, Rafael, what's your last name? My last name is Escobar. Now, Rafael, you're going to ask to number two, what is your surname? You're going to use surname, okay? Ask to number, number two, what's your, uh, what's your surname? Go. Uh, Escobar? No, no, no. You're going to ask number two. Sorry, I, I, I don't understand. Okay, because you're number one, I said... Um, Number one, what's your last name? Okay. And you answered. You said my last name is Escobar, right? So you're going to ask number two. So you're going to say, number two, what's your surname? Uh, surname is equal last name. It's the same. Last name. It's the same, yes. Uh -huh. Then, uh, what's your surname? Number two. Um, creo que soy yo. Yeah, number two. Yeah. <laughs> uh, my, my surname is... Um, ay, manzano. Okay, good. Okay, now you, number two, as number three, but you're going to say family name, okay? Uh, okay. Um, what's your name, family... No, no. What's your family name, number three? Very good, very my, good. My family name is Rodriguez. Very good. Now, you're number three, right? Number three, ask number four, and we go back to last name. Okay. What's your last name? Last name, yes. Okay, number three, ask number four, please. No sirve la conexión. No sirve la conexión. No? Okay, number four. Ask number five. Surname. No? Can, can you hear me, number five, number four? Okay, number five. Ask number six. What's your... Uh, I, I, I number four. Okay, number four, ask number five. What? Number four, ask number five. Ah, okay. Uh, what's your line? What's your line? No, less line. No, surname. Surname. Uh, what's your surname? Very good. My surname, my surname no one. Uh, what? Uh -huh. Sir, my, my surname mm, is, is, is is surname uh, no one. Hmm? Uh, is oh, the, one. Listen, listen. It's the same thing. 
eh, es la, la de la misma tres, de las tres formas se, se pregunta eh, eh, el apellido what's your last name cuál es tu apellido what's your surname cuál es tu apellido what's your family name cuál es tu apellido the same thing it's the same question okay it's just three different ways to ask is is name artis okay number five ask number six Mm. What's, uh, what's your family name? Good. Uh, my, my family name is Elias. Very good. Okay, so we are to number six. Listen, these are three different, different questions to ask for last name. What's your last name? What's your surname? What's your family name? It's the same thing, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go to the next. Okay, uh, number number six as number seven. Tony, where are you from? I am from San Salvador. Very good. Number seven as number eight. Where are you from? I am from San Salvador. Good. Number eight, ask number nine. Where are you from? Number nine. Okay, number ten, answer. No. Okay, let's move. I'm on. from Santa Ana. Sorry. Good. It's okay. It's okay. That, you're number ten, right? Yes. Okay, thank you very much. Let's move on to the next. Okay, number 10, ask 11. Uh, number 11, where do you, like, do you live? Very good. I live in Ilopango. Very good. Okay, 11, ask number 12. Okay, teacher. Where do you live? Number 12. I live in San Salvador. Very good. Uh, number 12, ask 13. Okay. Ask number 13, please. No? Okay, ask 14 then. Okay, let's move on. Let's let's continue to the next. Everybody, uh, fourteen to thirteen. Who is number fourteen? Hello. Okay. What do you pro What do you do? Very good. Thirteen. Who is thirteen? Lo respondo yo igual. Oh, mm, no, uh, let's go for number 12. Who is number 12? No. Okay. Um well, okay, you 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 answer Rafa then. Okay. Uh, I am a Spanish teacher. Very good. Thank you very much. Good, let's move on to the next. Okay, uh, I'm asking number one. Uh, number one, where do you work? Um, where do you work, number three? Wait, 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 no. I'm, I'm asking number one. Um, number, number one, okay. where do you work? Today, ask him. I work in a kindergarten. Very good. Number one, ask number two. Uh, number two, where do you work? Um, I work at kindergarten, Imaginación Creativa. Oh, okay, okay. Good, good. Okay, number three, ask number four. Or number four, ask number five. <laughs> No. 
Okay, let's move on to the next. Okay, number six, ask number seven. How, uh, how, how old are you? I am 50 uh, year old. Very good. Uh, number eight, ask number nine. Um, how old are you? Very good. Number nine. Wait, don't tell me. Bajo el micrófono. I am. Okay. I'm, I'm 30 years old. Very good. Let's see next. Okay, this next, next one. Listen, listen, we have different answers. The question is, Tony, are you married? What's your marital status? You can make this question in two. You can say the most common, are you married? But sometimes you're going to listen, what's your marital status? Okay, sometimes you're, you're going to listen to that. And you're going to say, I'm married, or yes I am, no I'm not, I'm single, no I'm not, I'm divorced, no I'm not, I'm a widow, no I'm not, I'm engaged, no I'm not, I live with a life partner. Any question in this one? Questions? No. So you understand that, right? Yeah. Teacher. Yeah. yeah. I have the question, teacher. Yes. I have, uh, I have, do you say divorce uh, with Dawi in Spanish? Widowed. Widowed Widow? mm -hmm. is, is um, when, when, your, when your wife or your husband dies. So you are a uh, widow. Uh, okay. Thank so you, what, What's that in Spanish? Viudo. Yes, viudo or viuda. Very good. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Il, il, teacher and uh, in, in that give. Engage. Engage? Comprometido. Comprometido. Okay. Comprometida. Engage. Mm -hmm. Any other question? No. Okay, good. Okay, um, number 10, ask number 11. Number 11, are you married? Yes, I am. Very good. 11, ask number 12. Are you married? 12. Are you married? Not 12. Oh, okay, 13. Make the question to 14. What is your marital status? Very good. Are you married? Um, wait, you are number 14? Are you married? Oh, no, I'm not. I'm single. Okay, uh, let's move on to the next one. I guess that you guys didn't, didn't listen who is number 14, who is 13, who is 12, and who is 11, because only 10 and down, they, they are responding. So let's see next. Everybody reading? Yes, teacher. Okay, good. Um, so as you can see, you can say the numbers in two digits. For example, my phone number is 7289-1653. My phone number is 7289-1653. So you can say two digits, okay? Okay, um, number one, uh, what's your phone number? Uh, my phone number is... Uh, Seven two five four nine six one six. Very good. Uh, number two, as number three. Okay, number three, as number four. Uh, number four, as number five. And uh, what's your 
uh, phone number right thank you okay um I'm guessing they have a problem with this. So let's move on to the next. Mm -hmm. OK, this is, what's your email address? Notice that with email, you you have this symbol, and it's at. You have the symbol is that. You have the symbol is dash. And you have the symbol is underscore. So when somebody asks me my email address, I say, my email address is the English guru at outlook.com. Now, uh, let's see. I'm going to ask, like, random. Beatrice, what is your email address? My email address is Sarah y Ariana. One, two, two, one, two, nine, at gmail.com. At gmail.com. .com, very good. Okay, Antonio, what's your email address? Uh, my email is um, a, a or this, uh, roba outlook.com dot com dot com no punto dot com dot com okay very good let's see Rocio what's your email address my email address is Rocio Manzano forty six at uh, gmail dot punto com dot com dot com okay dot com very good very good thank you very much Okay, Osana, what's your email address? My email address is Osana dab twenty seven at gmail dot com. Thank you very much. Okay, very good. So we we, we got that. Let's go to the next one. So what do you do in your free time? In my free time, I like to read. And what is the other one? Let's see. Sing and cook. That does the example. Okay, uh, Sophia, what do you what do you do in your free time? Sophia, what do you do in your free time? Okay, no. Um, Carla, what do you do in your free time? I, in my free time, I like to read and cook. Very good. Carla, ask Jose. Jose, what do you do? You, what do you do? What do you do? Jose, what, what do you do in your free time? Very good. In my free time, I like uh, I football. like to, I like to. I, I, I like to uh, play football. Very good. Okay, Jose, ask Antonio. Antonio, what do you do in your free time? My free time. In I, my free time. In my free time, I play the guitar. Wait, wait. I, I like to. I like to play the guitar. Very good. Uh, I like uh, listen to music. Very good. Only. Very good. Okay, um, Antonio, ask Beatriz. Um, Beatriz, what do you do in your free time? In my free time, I like to go to the beach very good very good okay um next year. okay um ask ask Osana please what do you in your free time 
What do you do? Free time. What do you do in your free time? time. What do you do in your free time? In my free in my free time, I like to see TV. To watch, to watch TV. To watch TV. Yes, in my free time, I like to watch TV. In my free time, I like to watch TV. Watch TV. Okay, next. Asking where are you from? So we're going to read this, okay? Uh, let's see where I am. Okay, first I'm going to read it and you just listen and then I'm going to ask for to read, okay? Asking where are you from? I live in a part of North Carolina where many people move to from out of town. The combination of universities and tech companies draws people to the states from all over the world. 30 or 40 years ago, cities like Kerry and Morrisville were sleepy little towns with a handful of streets and a couple of stop lines. Um, let's see, Antonio, can you read this please? I live in a part of North Carolina where many people move to from out of town. The combination of universities and these companies draw people to the state from all over the world. 30 or 40 years ago, cities like Kerry and Moviside were sleep Sleepy little town with a handful of three and a couple of top lights. Top lights. Top light. Very good. Thank you. Any questions here? Maybe pronunciation or the meaning of a, of a word? Vocabulary? Your teacher. Okay. Hi. And the Finnish uh, word. Um, Stop, please. Stop, Stop lights. Uh -huh. Stop lights. Uh, yeah, yes, Rosa. yes. Thank, thank you, Rosina. Uh -huh. Stop line is semaphoros. Uh -huh. Semaphoros. Thank you. Somebody yeah. else, any questions? Handful. Uh -huh. Handful. Un montón de. Un montón de calles. Handful. Any other? Um, couple. A couple. Y unas cuantas y unos cuantos semáforos en a couple of top lines y unos cuantos uh -huh. semáforos a sleepy a sleepy he sleepy. Sleepy. says Kerry and Morrisville were a sleepy little towns Kerry y Morrisville eran unos unos pueblitos pequeños dormidos uh -huh. another one no we we'll, we'll continue okay listen to this Today, there are major towns in North Carolina with a significant South Asian population. When my children attend the public school, there were more East Asian kids than any other ethnicity, followed by white kids, then South Asian kids. This is the new North Carolina. Let's see who's next. Rafa, can you read this, please? Yes. Thank you. Uh, today, there are major towns in North Carolina with a significant South Asian population. When my children attended public school, there were more East Asian kids than any other ethnicity, followed by white kids than South Asian kids. This is the new North Carolina. Good. Thank you very much. Any questions about vocabulary or pronunciation? Um, teacher, uh, this word major. Major. Uh -huh. There, are, there are major towns in North Carolina, meaning that 
population is big. A lot of people live there. Como grandes pueblos. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like a lot of people live there now. Okay. okay. Any other question? And technicity. Ethnicity. Ethnicity. Ethnicity, like eh, eh, razas o étnicas, like Latinos, like eh, Coreanos. So, you know, that's ethnicity. Okay, moving on. So, in light of this new diversity, it's okay and even expected to have people ask you, where are you from? Even though I have lived in North Carolina for most of the last 30 years, when people ask me where I'm from, sometimes I answer, Florida. It's true, I was born in Florida. I graduated from a high school in Florida. My parents and my and siblings all live in Florida. Florida is home. Okay, let's see who's next to read. Uh, Carla, can you read this please? So, in light of, of this new diversity, it's okay and ever expect, expected to have people ask you, where are you from? Even, even though I have lived in Northern Carolina for most of the last 30 years, where people ask the where the where I am from, sometimes I ask where Florida. It it's true. I was born in Florida in Florida Florida. I read graduated. I I graduated. I, I graduated from I have a school in Florida. My parents um siblings siblings um live in Florida. Florida is home. <laughs> Any questions, vocabulary here? No questions. Uh, siblings. My siblings. Parents and siblings. Siblings. Siblings is hermanos y hermanas. Revueltos. Ah, uh, ya. Yeah. No, no, hermano, hermana, sino que hermanos <coughs> en, en, en general. Siblings. Mm -hmm. Okay, any okay. other question? Teacher. Yes. How do you say sibling in Spanish? Eh, hermanos, pero revueltos, que no distingue si es eh, hembra o varón, hermanos. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Any other? No more question. Moving on then. Okay, this is part of the lovely ritual of getting to learn about one another. I am from many places. My heritage is Iranian. I was, I was raised in Florida. My spirit source in Turkey. My heart is in Switzerland. They are all home. Yes, I am from North Carolina and Iran and Florida. They are all home. But that's not what people mean when they ask me, where are you from? Okay, let's see who's going to read that. Okay, let's see who's next. Okay, Roberto, can you read this, please? This is, this is part of the lovely ritual of getting to learn about one another. I am from many place. places. Places. My, places, sorry. My... Heritage. Uh, Heritage is Iran, Iranian. I was raised right. in Florida. Raised, raised, raised. Sorry, raised in Florida. My spirit source in Turkey. Turkey. My hair is in Switzerland. Switzerland. They are at home. Yes, I am from North Carolina and. And Iran and Florida, they are at home, but that's not that people man, mean when they ask me when they ask me 
Where are you from? Very good, thank you. Okay, so any questions about vocabulary here? Heritage, what was my heritage? Heritage. Heritage, heritage. heritage. Herencia. Mm, thank Hereda, you. Heredar algo, so. so the experience sor source? Source, my spirit source. Uh, source means like, le, que le duele, le duele por no estar en un lugar. En este caso, a ella le duele no estar en Turquía. El espíritu okay. de ella está como, como que, como que extraña Turquía. Ok. Thank you. You're welcome. Any other question? No. Ok, guys, listen. Uh, we finished with our class today. Um, so we're coming back tomorrow. Um, so if you have any questions about anything, you already have my, my, my information. So you can write me at any time and I can answer to you as soon as possible, okay? So I will see you all tomorrow, okay? Okay, teacher. So you have a good nice night. Nice to meet you. Nice meeting you too, okay? Good have night, a good night. Nice. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good, Good night, night, everyone. Good night, everybody. Have a nice night.